We're going to go back down to Texas now, revisit with Jim Hunter and Jim Palmer with uh, Orioles manager Dave Tremblay. All right, Tom, thanks very much. Joined now by the skipper Dave Tremblay following tonight's loss. And uh, Dave, let's start with Brian Mattis, the shortest outing of his career. And I guess we have to remember it's only a 17th Major League start, but he learned the lesson tonight. If you don't make good pitches, they're going to get hit. You know, you give uh, Texas a lot of credit. They have great numbers against left-handed pitching, and it just wasn't Mattis's night. Um, you know, the only guy that, that really did a great job for us was Birkin. So Mattis is highly thought of. He's going to have his nights just like everybody else who's, who's pitched in the big league. So he'll learn from it. He'll adjust. He'll get better. You know, you, you talked to, we were talking on the bench before the game, obviously not as offensively minded as you would like. But a little bit light at the end of the tunnel tonight. You know, Antonez comes in, he gets a couple of hits early on. Even Adam Jones, the only guy that didn't get a hit in the lineup, gets a double later on. So you got to be a little bit happy, even though I know you could have scored a lot more runs, but you got to be happy with the, the seven runs. Well, you know, we've been waiting for us to break out. Tonight was a step in that right direction. I wish we could have got a few more hits, especially with two outs. But, you know, it didn't happen. This is the first time where we've given up 10 or more runs. Our starting pitching has been, for the most part, you know, great for us. And it just so happened it wasn't tonight. And, uh, you know, just give your... Tip your cap, give all the credit in the world to the Rangers. They swung the bats, got all the big hits. We fought ourselves back into it and uh, did the very best we could. So uh, we'll learn from it. Uh, I'm just hoping that the offense maybe can get started after some of the ad pats the guys had tonight. All right, Dave, we appreciate the visit. We'll see you in Washington. All righty. Manager Dave Tremblay, and, uh, you know, maybe there will be a carrier of it because, as you mentioned, seven hits. Uh, of course, he'd be happier if they didn't leave the 15 on base, but you got to start somewhere, and they got them on base. Yeah, and I think the other thing, uh, Luke Scott, a little uncomfortable over first base, but he's probably going to play there, even though it'll be a couple of left-handers uh, pitching for the Nationals. So he got a chance to acclimate himself, and, uh, you know, hopefully he will not hurt them defensively over the course of uh, the weekend because you need his bat in the lineup. A you know, big offensive night for the Rangers. They wanted to complete the two-game sweep. Let's send it back to the studio and Tom and Rick.